Hey guys, welcome to TSN TV. This I'm, is Lindy Jar. I'm Banjo. <laughs> Chaos Overdrive. It's too late, bro. <laughs> See, this is this is why we it need just, to. This is why we got to go. Welcome to TSN TV. Uh, honestly, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> that is so sultry. You might as well turn down the fucking lights <laughs> when you do that too. So we got we got uh we got a show now. We got a show uh with with Chaos OD and our fearless queen. Uh, Lindy Jar, that and queen. we got a yeah, she's back. She's back, and she, we got a third chair for her. So now uh, <laughs> we can talk about stuff. We can talk about stuff that we always talk about. It's just it's in front of a camera at this time. So um, uh, Chaos OD has bad opinions. Oh yeah, this this. So I don't think I have bad we're, opinions. We're just, I think I, I just have different opinions than everybody else. That does not make them bad. So we recently discovered that Matt has a thing against Aladdin, the new uh, remake. Look, I, okay, so first off, let me preface. I love Disney movies. Like, mm -hmm. people's kids, children are like, what are we going to do today? I'm like, yo, let's watch some old Disney movies. I'm down for that. That's what I do. Little Mermaid, Hercules, all my jam, do guys. Don't don't get – yes. Preface. Oh yes. Preface. Bro, I will watch Sweeney Todd and sing every movie. Is just I, I'm, I'm good. Sweeney That's what Todd. I do, right? Sweeney Todd is dope. But preface, he actually never gave us his information. He just – he just he basically went on a rant. <laughs> he went he went on a rant I about went. how look look he went on a rant about how the genie in Aladdin was going to be a bad genie because it was Will Smith. Yes. Yeah, okay. So did. this is my gripe, guys. So when Robin Williams did his voice <laughs> for genie, it didn't sound like a white guy. It didn't sound like uh, you know over the top cliche racist like Arabic guy, right? He sounded like a whole new creation. He sounded like a blue genie. I was to say he's a genie. Like what else would he that's sound like? That's what he like? sounded like. But that's it, that <laughs> was the character dimension. he embodied, and, and right? What this what this man's gripe is about is he Will takes Smith. That, okay. Okay, so let's just play the trailer first. No, 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 no. Will Smith is this. going to sound overly black. Oh come on! It's he is going to sound overly think, ethnic. I don't. He think is going to do this. And it's not gonna be the genie that anybody wants. I'm calling it right now. Okay, well, right now we gonna play so, the, we gonna play so this Matt, trailer. Matt's actually never watched the trailer for the. I know the it doesn't one. have Will Smith in it. So let's roll into it. So we are gonna play this trailer, right? Let, let let's see what, what we got. And this is a side by side comparison mm -hmm. between the actual animated one and the real life one. So it, it, they're already showing you they're tryharding real good right now. Just saying. I mean, do you really want to like half-ass a Disney movie? Or do Ooh, you look at that. I mean, they already are doing that by getting Will Smith to do the genie. Okay. Oh, my God. Ooh, that Disney logo. Yeah, bro, this is fresh. Bro. Whoosh, this I is, guess. This is I mean, fresh, bro. I mean, yeah, they're doing a, a, a really good shot by shot, but they don't. They could have just pulled lines from Robin just Williams. Watch the trailer. Just watch the trip. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even see the bottom one, but. It's like super dark. It's super grimy. Ooh, the voice. Yeah, bro. That's tight. Ooh. Bro. This is dope, bro. Oh, this. This is oh, dope, I'm, bro. I'm so against some of these live action movies. This is so fresh, bro. It's like, fresh. Are you serious? Look at this, bro. You wouldn't. Ooh. You wouldn't. You wouldn't pay money to see this movie. Just because Will Smith is the genie, I got a better. Okay, who would you who would you rather have as the genie? That's not Robin Williams or Will Smith. Hell, I don't care. Pick Ron Perlman. I don't give a damn. Just as long as it's not him. Just because you said Ron Perlman. So what if it's Kevin Hart? What if it's Kevin Hart genie? Like, come on. No, I hate Kevin Hart too. Don't do it. Do we have do we have to pick an African American to be genie? Okay. Is this the stigma that we're on? Is this is that like that that black James Bond stuff? Right. Everything has to be progressive. No, we're just saying that. What if it was a female genie? Like, what if what if they did that? Hey, I'm cool with that. I'm actually more cool with that. I'm actually more cool <laughs> if they had picked a female to be genie than Will Smith. I don't care. I said it. They I said it. They would have casted Melissa McCarthy guaranteed. <laughs> guaranteed they would have did that. They would have had Melissa McCarthy, uh, Kate McKinnon, one of these Saturday Night Live women. Oh, hold on. What's the, what's the, the, 
the black chick from Saturday Night Live that's like Leslie. Uh, Leslie, yeah, I would have oh, loved her a as a genie. That that, can I get Leslie Jones but or whatever wants, her name is? It's already he, made. He, <laughs> wants, he, he, he say he's saying yes to Leslie, but no to Will, Will Smith. Smith. He yes, just, I feel like because he's I feel a problem like against Will Smith Leslie's here. the blackest woman on earth. Look, but she won't. Like, look, the way she's the blackest woman on earth, bro. He Are just has serious? an issue with. Is Will it like Smith? Jada Pinkett Smith? Probably the w- blackest woman like on earth. No, that's just Will Smith's wife. Did you have an? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Did you have an issue against like Fresh Prince of Bel Air growing up or something? No. Like, is this why you no, don't like? It? I actually <laughs> like Fresh Prince of Bel Air. What he's saying? I what have he's, nothing what, against what Will saying. Smith. I just don't like <laughs> what he's saying. He's a genie. What he's saying. <laughs> Leslie would have made a better genie. He doesn't want this genie to be like to have like black mannerisms throughout the throwout the movie. He wants it to be like its own like. like he you might as well get Denzel he, Washington if he's he gonna get some black it? mannerisms no, in here, right? No, Denzel Washington. Training day genie? You don't want that. <laughs> hey, smoke this. How do you want it, Aladdin? <laughs> he just has a little lamp. <laughs> Yo, we can do this. We can do this all day. Rub that lamp, Aladdin. <laughs> Here you go. Drop the A and everything, Aladdin. What you, you doing, Aladdin? Do this all day, Aladdin. <laughs> Aladdin. However you want to do, Aladdin. Palace Let it go, Palace, Aladdin. <laughs> so <laughs> exactly, and that's how I feel. Like Will Smith is gonna do it. So if you gotta pick a African American actor, you might as well get. Yo, Him. I want can I Morgan. get a I hood Mo- Aladdin though? You can't have Morgan Freeman genie. That's unexciting. Morgan. That is not no. exciting at all. But you no. want the you want the girl from Saturday Night Live. Okay, yeah, yes. okay. <laughs> She's se- better than Will Smith. We're gonna segue, right? <laughs> we're gonna segue into this nice shirt that he's wearing. My shirt. I is really cool. now. I really don't care about Fallout, but. For my mans right here, we are going to uh, delve into some of these dope special editions that are coming out for these wonderful video games. Starting with Fallout Starting 70. with 76, Fallout baby. Fallout, Fallout 76. So can we, can we get a can we segue into this? Uh, I want to know what I'm going to buy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you're going to buy it. Everybody should buy it. It's one of the best special editions ever. First off, you get this dope-ass helmet. And this helmet works, guys. Yeah. Like, you can put it on your face. Works. Like, I wish the game came out sooner so I could wear the helmet for Halloween. So the cool thing about this is, like, I remember growing up playing, like, the originals. And, like, this was so fucking, like, important way back in the day. Like, you had the face and the mask, like, right on the first case. And you're like, oh, I want that. And now you can have it. Like, you can have it on your face. So first they gave us a Pip-Boy with the release of Fallout 4 Special Mm -hmm. Edition, right? And now this time around, they're gonna give you the actual helmet from the power suit, and then you get a glow-in-the-dark map. Because in case you need to find yourself in the dark. Oh, I mean, right. why? No, it's because it's it's a radio. Act- yeah, it's, it's <laughs> yeah, 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 it's yeah, radioactive, yeah, yeah. bro. Yeah, so you put it tight. on your wall. I need a Geiger counter. That's all I needed this set to come with. But as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, it comes with a whole bunch of cool stuff, and you put it with some of the pre-existing stuff that's already come out for the Fallout games, and you put that with this awesome-ass game anyway. I think it's a good buy. I it's honestly a, think it's a, it's a okay, good buy. Okay, so in, in terms of like special editions, like a dank one was like when Black Ops 3 released and you got like the Juggernaut fridge and that was like $120. For and that was dope. A, for a mini fridge. But a lot of these special editions are like kind of OD. You're talking about no, that. Yeah, like uh, nowadays, I feel like they're just getting better. Like they're worth your money. Like this one is uh, $199. So for $200, you could get this The mask. helmet, you get the map. You get little figures too that go on the Metal map. pins, everything, man. I think, it's a, I think it's a really good buy. And then like for $120, you could have got the fridge. That's uh, a 120 for a mini fridge and the game? That's Now that's let's a, talk about a bad buy. A lot of people bought it, too. And you know what I'm going to bring up? The Easter egg, Infinity Stones. For <laughs> bro, Mario no, listen, versus listen, Capcom. listen, listen, listen. <laughs> my roommate, Victus, he, he, I he, can make better Infinity Stones at home, dude. This man got some Fisher-Price Easter uh, eggs. Easter eggs. <laughs> going, going, bro. Bruh, and it's just like. Yo, I actually saw those two in person like you have. Like, they're not. Mm-mm. Oh, this is not So that That's friend. an example that's of. Not it. to buy special edition. Fallout 76 is definitely an example of what to buy. You know, Soul Calibur 6 oh, also the had the statue and a book and Did all this other stuff. Uh, it does come with the first wave of so DLC as well. So and I, I, didn't, didn't you bring up the Red Dead box? Yeah, the Red Dead box. Bro, you get like a, a bandana, some playing cards, a puzzle, like uh, uh, you get a like metal a, box. a metal box, a metal tin. You get a metal with a little lock, lock a little lock lid. Yeah, yeah, Yo, like, I'm that ready. One, and that one though is a hundred bucks. Like that's worth it too. Like so like, that one. Okay, so the Red Dead box is a hundred bucks, mm-hmm. right? And then the Fallout box is two hundred bucks. 
but then you get uh, like a functioning like piece of wearable <laughs> equipment too. Yeah, you get so, that, I mean, the that's pretty tight. Cards, you get uh, the pins, the little metal pins. Yeah, and then both it. of them come with the DLC mm -hmm. and stuff like that. And then, um, yeah, so that that's definitely a great example of a good, you know, to buy bundle and an example of a not to good yeah, like, buy bundle. Yeah, I love like going back to that uh, the marble one, like. I love that in the photo you could see the reflection over the ones that you were gonna buy. Like they're like, hey, it's always been here. Like this is what you're getting. Like and then you get the these Easter eggs. Enough, like the reflection was like what it actually looked like, and it was like Damn. so horrible. <laughs> okay. And then uh, <laughs> speaking of special edition, didn't Dragon Ball even get like a, a special edition? Yeah, the Dragon one Ball point? one was really good. I really liked the the fact that it came with like the Goku statue. Like that. Dragon on its Ball. Own. That 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 one was dope. But before before we go into the into the next topic, right? Which I know we're all chomping at the bit at. I, I want to like see some like some overzealous like special edition. So the one I found, the one I just looked up is the, the Resident Evil 2 remake, right? So I don't know. That one's tight though. I'm not paying six hundred and seventy five dollars for a keyboard. I want wait. It. It's, it's six hundred dollars. It's a typewriter, yeah. isn't it? It's for, not a keyboard. No, it's a typewriter. It's a dope, dope it a, AF typewriter. It is, but a, it is a 1960s keyboard. It's pro. It's proto. It's a proto keyboard, I which want is it. typewriters. I'm not gonna pay six hundred seventy-five. He looked at me. He looked at me and was like, "I'm not buying. I'm not gonna pay six hundred seventy-five dollars." Okay. I mean, it's not like it's eighty-six hundred dollars <laughs> like the Dante damn yeah, like, jacket let's, let's though. Let's talk about that. Yeah, you get the, the hey, the see, DMC Vince, this is jacket? see, Vince. This is why we got the the camera with the. With the with the remote on it, get that get that camera, yeah. I want you to pan in, pan in on, <laughs> pan in on one of them, bro. <laughs> on how one much of us? how much money would you pay for for would you pay eighty six hundred dollars for a, a jacket that they wore from the mocap? This isn't this is this is from the mocap. Eighty six hundred dollars. Would you wear it? I would. I would. Because see, like at least. For like cons and Halloween, you definitely gotta wear that. So be, the fact that it's a leather outfit too, like it's all it's leather, it's yeah, like authentic, and I feel like you could wear it to like the Renaissance Festival, like all this stuff, because it's literally just a leather jacket. Like if you look at but it, but you look like Dante different. or Virgil that's or a Nero. That's and a like cash if you're a hardcore car. fan, if you're a hardcore it fan, is. you're spending can... like three hundred dollars when each statue comes out, because like the statues for that game are already really hard to find for any of those characters. People spend legit money for those. So I feel like spending that much for to get the coat is like whatever. You and it's an actual it. coat. Do it. <laughs> like it's literally a prop piece that they use. So I mean, yes, out of every normal person's budget, right? But for those fans, you're buying a piece of the game. 86 and 86 You're buying a piece <laughs> of the game. There are people who crowdfund things way <laughs> higher than 8600 that a, never get a piece a of a anything. Go listen. Go yeah. fund me for it. Yeah. Please help me. Listen, listen. Please help. Listen. I need this coat. That's we not, need to share this coat. We going to share the coat. That's not true Forget because this. because because somebody did a, a GoFundMe for potato salad, right? <laughs> what? His goal, his goal, somebody uh, the true story. You can look this up. So there was a goal of $10 for the potato salad and if you donated Toward toward the potato salad, you did get a small serving of the potato salad. Well, His but goal, what if you were from like out of town? Like, did he send you? The did potato he send salad? you the potato salad? <laughs> That's actually a good question. But uh, <laughs> I I digress. Like he, the goal was ten dollars, and uh, the backers of the ten dollar potato salad, you got a scoop of said potato salad. This man made fifty grand. You can look it up. He made fifty three thousand dollars off some trying potato to get, salad off a of meme. He made fifty three grand. Off potato salad. <laughs> so don't. So let's not. So, so I'm gonna start to go film me for Soul not, Calibur and hope that somebody just buys me an entire new PlayStation. It's, it's, true. <laughs> it's true. It's true. It's true. So, so oh let's not. God. Let's not knock. Uh, you know, like like nobody's gonna you know do some stuff like <laughs> hey, this. Hey, I, I would pay for that. Potato because salad. Somebody, some, some this man made fifty. This man made fifty three grand off the meme. The meme of like oh. You already made twenty grand. What's another ten dollars? Millions of people, um, millions of people donating like one, two, like bro, like fifty three grand. Start a GoFundMe if you're gonna make but a GoFundMe. Yo, I'm going home to make a GoFundMe potato. tonight. No, no, look for my link. I don't know what it's gonna be about, but it's gonna it's gonna be about seventy six. I need seventy six. There we go, let's guys. Let's be real though. Like, how much potato salad this man have to make though? Like, this man, this man <laughs> made this man made one made, bowl. His goal was ten dollars, so he, he made a bowl. But he said everyone that donated would get a piece of it, so he had to like still send those people that. You know, at, at that point, I salad. wouldn't even eat the damn potato salad. I would have made the bowl right. Portioned it out, sent everybody their potato salad, and what with the fifty grand, just salad. go and eat at a buffet. I don't even want potato salad anymore. You don't even need a fifty. <laughs> I want a lobster at, a at this point. Can you I get a lobster? You could have took the additional just ten more dollars outside of the goal and 
went to a buffet. If you want to start like a GoFundMe, start a GoFundMe for these for these shoes for me. Yeah. My my oh, PayPal oh, yeah. is TCG98 at Yahoo.com. Oh my go ahead. god, there's go the ahead, real Vince. plug. So, go ahead, there it goes. Yeah, now we now you can now you can do the the, the Yeah, the show slide. us show us. So Banjo and I really, really, really are excited about yeah. these. So basically Adidas is releasing a Dragon Ball collection. Ooh, this is the so Adidas sexy. this is the Pro Sphere uh, uh from Adidas. Uh, so Adidas is releasing several shoes inspired by our favorite anime. Well, most of everybody's favorite anime. The history of this anime is so so deep, and now it's gotten to a point to where we're making shoes based we off. We can of wear them now. We can wear them now. Now this one is called the Cell. It's a it's an Adidas. It's an Adidas. I like the Cell, man. It's, yeah. it's pretty tight. I like, I like the that. color scheme on them. Like I I think it's beautiful. Yeah. I love the like the fact that they kept the scaling on the bottom of the shoe. Yeah. They made it like real reminiscent of like you know the best Dragon Ball Z villain by far, mm -hmm. and <laughs> boom. it's uh it's uh it's two tones, so it's green on this side, but on the other side it's purple, and it comes in my size, size 14, releasing October 27th. Uh, TCG98 14. at Yahoo.com. If you guys just want to donate, <laughs> oh my uh, god, that'd be really that I really really appreciate that. But this shoe is it's is so actually fresh. limited. And none of these shoes are over like two hundred dollars, so they're actually like you know. So they're actually reasonably priced yes. on top of yeah. being awesomely designed. This next shoe is a hundred dollars. Show them, show them that, so uh, show them that Gohan. Yeah, oh. that's fresh. Uh, I'm I not. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. You know what these shoes and kind my, of remind me of? My favorite right. color is purple, man, but I really feel like those cells really outshined what this should be as a Gohan shoe. See, I, I think like they could have done something different. The stitching, the yellow stitching. Now, if you had told me this was the Frieza shoe and they had thrown some pink in this. I would have believed that more than to been the Gohan shoe. And I'm not saying I don't like the shoe. I li I don't like the fact that so it's what, Gohan's shoe. So what would you have shoe. done if this was your like you were designing the shoe? Like what would you have changed? So first off, this would have definitely like I said. I been feel like purple like, wouldn't have been the color I chose too. I don't know. Do you why. see what I'm saying? Yeah, like, like yeah, it's not like the shoe is bad. I think the design and the color scheme of the shoe is really well. But to name it Gohan, no. No, this definitely should have had some pinks in it, some fuchsias in it, some whites, and yeah. we should have just called that the freezer. I want a fusion. We shoe. should have just called that the freezer. I, I mean, <laughs> that's what I was about to say. This is the team go. This is this is the, this is the Gohan that was gonna end the series. <laughs> Look, man, when I when you say <laughs> Gohan to me, I'm thinking like Lightning Legs Adult Unlocked <laughs> Gohan. Okay. And this shoe does not scream. Unlocked Gohan. It's, it's the same. It's the same color. It would be the same colors as the. So as the I need Goku. this to be named the Teen Gohan. Then, if you're gonna do this, do it right. Then. Actually, Don't call it the Gohan. <laughs> call it the Teen Gohan. Yeah, actually, let let's go to the. Okay, so okay, so you're not you're not a fan. You're not a fan of the Gohan. It's I'm not a fan, a fan of the fan name. Of the name. I'm a fan of the shoe. The I, shoe I can't, looks I can't, correct. I can't get it the shoe. It is fine. It kind of reminds I me of a mountain. I just don't think it's named. I know it does go up like the peak of a mountain. Down. Yeah. Um. But I don't think that it should have been. It should have been Teen Gohan, and I wouldn't have had anything to say about that. Okay. But saying Gohan makes me think of Adult Gohan, and I this shoe does not remind me of Adult Gohan. Okay, well, this next shoe is definitely going to curl his toes. Go ahead and hit him with the advance. Woo! Oh, my God. Well, that. Now, that is Woo! a shoe. That is the hotness. Woo! In fact, Shinra should be moving in the background. How hot that is. Like, ha! That's why he got his mouth open right now. Hot. That's hot. Bro. You know what I love about these? I love that they still have the Adidas stripes on them. Like they're there, it and then you got the dragon the scale kind of pattern yeah, too. Yeah, and then the back of it, like the little fucking green little, I guess scales. That's yeah, like uh, scales. this is this is called this is the Adidas uh, EQT, but the it's like the material on it is like mesh. So when you put it on, it stretches like a sock. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. So they should be comfortable oh, yeah. on top of that. And you know what? I really like the the small touch of white. I always hate white on shoes because I feel like it's done on purpose. Like, you know these damn shoes going to be near the ground. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have to <laughs> clean, clean these shoes all the time. Okay. Uh, but with the little touch of white and the, the rest of the shoe screaming Shinron, I actually like it. Now, I like this shoe a lot. There's also like a black and gold variant that's not on here, but... With every Dragon Ball Z pack, there's two shoes that come in it. I think there's two shoes that come in um, uh, the there's two shoes that come in the collection that release on the same day based on like epic fights. Yeah. So you got Goku versus Frieza. Okay. Teen Gohan versus uh, Cell versus Cell. Majin Buu versus uh, Vegeta. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Right. And then these are last. Yeah. And it's the these and the black ones. So I guess there would be Shinron and Omega Shinron. Yeah. yeah. So the Omega ones are like. They're black and gold. They look just like this in the color schemes, all black. But where you see like the red and stuff, that's gold. 
beautiful. Then, it's it it act, looks gorgeous. Like like these are probably like out of all the shoes like that probably. I think the Shinrons are the hottest. Yeah, I want these. I don't know. You ain't seen the Majin Boos yet. The Majin you know, I might I might mess the with the Majin, Majin Boos. You ain't seen well the Majin Boos yet, dog. Ooh, the like I'm I'm gonna be ready for those two, and especially since you know Kid Boo was one of my favorite villains. So I'll definitely have to see what they look like in cop. So, so those Justin too. Wong. Mark, man, I know y'all in that sneaker community up there, wherever y'all live at, bro. Like, hook a, hook a brother <laughs> up, bro. Vegas and New York and all that. New hook Yorkians. A, hook a brother up, bro. I know y'all got the plug, man. We I, we need to know we about need it. Yeah, We need really those. We need those, bro. All right. I'll and be setting up a GoFundMe as well after this, <laughs> <Right>? too. <laughs> The, so just look out for that. Like, I'm not a big fan of the Goku ones, you guys, when you look them up. Uh, I saw the Goku the ones. Goku they're okay. Ones they okay, look like Goku, and I appreciate them for looking like Goku. I yeah. feel like they look just too generic, like too generic adidas -y. Like they're uh, like, let's just change the color scheme to orange and blue. I think that's what <laughs> listen, makes them cool, actually, listen, though. But the what thing would you wear them with? Like, come on. The thing is, is yo, that, like, everybody got the one piece, like, like you know what I'm talking about? They already yeah. got the uniforms on. <laughs> like, I saw a dude in the mall wearing damn near the whole uniform from head to toe. Really? And, like, because it was a hoodie that's oh, shaped yeah, like that, right. and then you can get a beanie as well. Yeah. So I mean, like, <laughs> what you slap on some black pants, and then there you go, bitch! I look like Goku. Like I honestly, like honestly, <laughs> like start spiking your hair up, walking through the mall. Out of all of like the shoes that probably the released this year, like those might be the best ones. Like I've seen like plenty of other like Adidas yeah, yeah. and stuff that that released, but for like, sure in the those, Adidas collection, I think those are. But the best. those are just like yo, they're this too is fresh. these are, and it's like very difficult to get because they're so reasonably priced and. I, I really want With them shoes. being reasonably priced, see, that's my big gripe about buying shoes is that, once again, you know, you got to walk around in these things. And I don't, I don't like tiptoeing around. Tiptoeing in my yeah. – I don't like I, doing that not, you know, well, in my and shoes. you're not going to wear them all the time. These are like – you're wearing them to, like, I'm Texas aware. showdown. I'm like, aware you're wearing them, them somewhere. Like, to a, to a specific place. Up. I'm definitely going to wear these shoes all the time. Oh, yeah. See, they're going to they're gonna get broke up. But, but have, it like, don't matter because the they're, nice, they're a nice price. So I wouldn't even feel bad for, like, if these shoes got ruined. Like, they're and not, like, $300 no, pair of shoes. No, because they're never going to make them again. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're right. And it's, um, it's not like I'm going to beat them to death, but I am going to wear them. Yeah. Like, okay, you so You just look. buy the little covers yeah. when you go out in the rain. You just, the walk, <laughs> you just walk in baggies. That way you don't, like, mess this up is, your shoe. There so you go. The cool thing about, like, these shoes is that, like, it's the attention to detail. Like, if you really, like pick up one of these like Gokus you'll see the the fabric is like you know all like uh, clothy and stuff and mm -hmm. it's like sort of it has the like, like almost a suede touch to it but yeah. it's almost but it's like the it's ripped up in a way that's reminiscent of Goku when he fought Frieza. Yeah, like the, oh. the stripes. So if you look at it, like the stripes are like they're jagged. not solid. They're jagged. Ah, yeah. so it's like battle worn too. Like Bat it, that's the word. There you go. It's there battle worn. Yeah. It's battle worn. Thank Gundam for that term. And, and like uh, the, <laughs> the kid blue ones, like when they come out, they look kind of fluffy. Like they look yeah. uh, like they look puffy. And they look it's puffy. Really they look. Really oh cute. man, cute. I'm cute. ready. I'm ready. I'm telling you, my body's dude, ready, bro. Yeah, I'm that. That's in a. I like that collection because I also feel it's functional. Like, it doesn't look over the top. Like, we're trying to make these shoes look... Like, stand yeah. out as Dragon yeah, Ball shoes. We're trying to make these look yeah. like, no, like straight-up the... Dragon Ball shoes. Like, no, these look like shoes. You could walk around and, like, unless you know what they are, you're, you're going to be like, oh, okay, they're just shoes. But for people that really like sneakers, they're like... Oh, or the or are, the anime, those are yeah. Those shoes. You should oh, be able yeah. to recognize them yeah, off yeah. the back, like oh yo, the freezes. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking don't of go robbing. Speaking don't of go. speaking of anime, <laughs> I I did want to bring up this topic actually, which is was it Goblin Slayer. Honestly, oh, yeah, no, I no because I want to see like what what's the what's the hubbub like. I, Have you seen the first episode? No. Okay. Goblin Slayer. Yeah. Uh, is this on Netflix, right? I don't think it's on Netflix. Oh, okay. uh, I did watch it off an of off-brand website. But, okay. all right, so okay. my thing with Goblin Slayer, right, people are so like, oh, like, I haven't seen the second episode. The first episode, um, it tried to it tried to draw me in for a second. And then when it gets to the end of the episode and he shows how 2D this plot is going to be, like, I slay goblins. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, wait, you just did all that badass stuff, right? But your only narrative... <laughs> It's to slay these goblins. Like I don't know. I don't know. You you got you got so far. Like you're running down the hallway. You're an awesome <laughs> anime, and then you just stopped, and you're just like, nope. This yeah. is all we're doing. We're, we 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 want to stop short of Sao. We don't want to be those guys. You know, we're, we're we're the gritty Sao. We we don't mind killing and doing all other kinds of lewd stuff. I heard. But S I heard Sao was trash. Don't blaspheme like that. I heard it was trash. I didn't say Look, it was some trash. of the later seasons weren't okay. as good I, as the earlier so seasons. Is, so is trash. The earlier seasons so are good, 
and so I will fight you. Don't at me. I agree. Uh, it's trash. I agree it's not trash. Our production guy so over there is saying trash. It's, it's not trash. trash. It's trash. Anyway, so you're Goblin Slayer. <laughs> Goblin Slayer is trash. Uh, it's not as good it, as so everybody is it. saying it is. I know you guys don't have an opinion on it, but Common Rider Black made me sit up and watch episode one, and it started off good, and then he got to, like I said, <laughs> all I'm going to do this entire episode and this entire narrative is hunt goblins, and I, I was like out. <laughs> I checked out. I checked out immediately. That'd be like Lord of the Rings being like, nah, we're only gonna like the Hobbit's like, nah, we're only gonna hunt goblins. We're gonna we're gonna take the nah. eagle straight to the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. We're <laughs> only dropping off this ring. We're not, you know, we're not gonna meander through Mount Doom. We're not gonna go through all these backward <laughs> countries. We're not gonna go to Helm's Deep or anything. We're gonna hop on the eagles and go straight to Mount Doom. That <laughs> is Goblin Slayer. I'm here to hunt goblins. Okay, so then that's the, it. So what's the anime that's like that people say is good that you think is bad? Everybody, get ready for it. Oh gosh. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. This dude is garbage. <laughs> this dude is garbage. Oh my god. Season no. one and two. One and two. This dude we is watched Dio, it together. Dio and Cars. Best villains, and then after that, they're like, "Let's go on a journey to Egypt. We suck." And then that was it. That was <laughs> it. <laughs> Dude, that was Even it. Even the song became garbage. Like during that. Yeah, season, yeah. Like, w- walk like an Egyptian. <laughs> Bro, it's supposed to be the. This it went is the from <laughs> this amazing intro to this garbage like intro, and we're like, oh. <laughs> 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 No, but like, that was it. That was it. So you asked. I hope you liked it. I didn't. Well, well yours? too bad. Okay, like an anime that's like that I don't like that everybody likes. Uh, Gurren Lagan. F- Gurren Lagan. Oh my god. Gurren Lagan is Bro, trash. Bro, you are trash. Gurren Lagan is garbage. Tra- Drill to the Heavens is the best shit ever. And then they turned around and gave us Kill a Kill. The same no. studio <laughs> produced two <laughs> back to back bangers. Turn it back on. How dare you put Turn it back on. Two back to back bangers. Two back to back bangers. Are you serious? Gurren Lagan is garbage. And You're garbage. Let me finish. Gurren Lagan garbage. Let That's what finish. you are. Let me finish. Because uh, in the middle, first off, spiral, spiral energy. That's the dumbest concept. That is <laughs> our heart. That's our soul, listen to bro. How you listen that to is how our you, soul. Listen to how you sound. It is it's piercing the heavens. It's, it's their it's soul. piercing Dude, the fucking it's heavens. It's dumb. Soul. Okay, listen. And and in the yeah. what was it? The last episode <laughs> where that hamster transformed to a young boy. Like I'm done. We're done here. We're done. What? What are you against hamsters turning into young boys? It's stupid. <laughs> it happened. It happened for no reason. So wait, you got these dumbass stand users that have no reason to be in JoJo. Uh, first as off, for filler, first off, filler, mind the lore. I, mind, mind the lore. Stand users. Mind the lore. Can we go back to Hamon? Hamon was where yeah, the Hamon show was actually amazing. ah light energy. <laughs> so hold on, wait a minute. You can get down <laughs> with light energy, Hamon, but you can't get down with spiral energy. They come from the same spot, my G. Something wrong with you. That's stupid. Some oh, that's, oh that's, that's stupid. That's, that's okay. Dumb, you sound like the guy who will like Goblin Slayer. <laughs> then I, enjoy having that. <laughs> enjoy I, that. My anime, my anime that I didn't like was Bleach, and I'm, I know. Okay, see, I'm, I'm with you right All right, so that's our cross the board. No, that's Bleach I started off really not. good, and yeah. then they just threw it in the trash. I they literally couldn't. threw it in the I trash. I couldn't. Like I was like, no, nah, not for to me. To me, a lot of people are also gonna agree with this, uh, or maybe disagree with this. I don't even know. But the end of Bleach was effective when they captured Eisen. Good luck. That was it. End of the story. <laughs> <laughs> we come from Waco Mundo. <laughs> we have our last battle. Capture Aizen. Boom. He's in a prison. Anime over. Roll yeah, credits. Good. Stop there. Roll you, credits. Like That's just, it. There's just so much filler. There's just I, I just couldn't. couldn't it was it. Okay. torturous. Well, this so is this is times. this is well. An- Bleach was made in a period where like anime didn't get the tech of no fillers yet. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They That's true. Look they, at Naruto. Yeah. Yeah. But I like some of the Naruto fillers, though. Some of them. I'm not saying all of them were good. And they but have, some of them were pretty tight. I and they have, a, they have a remedy for that. Like, literally, you could buy, like, all the Ninja Storm games and play. And play it, yeah. You can play it and get the, the, the whole entire story. story. Okay, so that's how that's I got to that's that's do it because I've never watched all of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's the way to go, to you be can honest literally with get you. The, you can get the entire lore of Naruto in four games. Don't play multiplayer. Just play the story <laughs> mode. Don't, yeah. don't, don't, don't play multiplayer. I'm sorry if you guys don't, like that. Don't play the online, right? Yeah, that's Don't do that. It's going to take you an hour only just to play one game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, only, only <laughs> villains do that. My Hero Academia, though, I can't wait. For yeah. the my, hero, my Hero is live, and we're going to get into more uh, actually scary stuff. 
Uh, apparently, this guy thinks like uh, these people think that Rob Zombie is a good movie director. Okay, we'll get into for that some reason, but we'll get into that like next week. That's uh, next week, though. Y'all, y'all that's hold on week. to that. Okay, but I'm gonna tell y'all why. But that's next week. Next week for sure. All so right, so we wrapping up now. Yeah. Guys? So yeah. coming up next week, we're gonna do a spooky. Spooky, Spooktober. Spooktober. It's also going to be the week leading up to my birthday, so it'll be like Yay, Spooktober Linda slash birthday. Linda's birthday. We're going to do a, a GoFundMe for Linda's birthday, too. We're just doing GoFundMe's for everything now. <laughs> so just be ready Go for the, the flurry of GoFundMe Go for a new, a new production. <laughs> <laughs> Especially. Let's get rid of Vince. <laughs> we got we to gotta get rid of Qualia, we man. With that. No, it's just help us feed events. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that. Remember that. <laughs> Remember that. I didn't say that. But we're going to get out of here for now. Just tune in next week. This is going to be a weekly thing. Yeah. Just like the weekly bracket. This is uh, TSN TV. I'm Banjo. I'm Lindy Jar. Chaos Overdrive, guys. And we will see you guys next week. <laughs> Stop recording. <laughs> Are you serious right now? <laughs> <laughs>